Hi you guys and welcome to another video. I am so glad that you're here and I hope that everyone out there is doing well. This video is for hashtag ATC MDC Open Collab and it is hosted by Life with Patty and Bonnie from Bonnie's Corner. And the purpose of this open collab is to help you build your stash. All you have to do to join is upload a video on any Thursday showing us your memory decks cards or your artist trading card. We would love to see them. I have so much fun looking at all of the videos in the playlist for the hashtag. So if you're subscribed to my channel, then you probably have already seen this memory decks card that I created. I did design it in Cricut Design Space and I'm offering this file for free. It has this shape to the memory decks card already in it as well as the flowers. I have all of the information you need to get this download in the description box below. So I went ahead on and did another one since I'm joining a couple of challenges this month that require memory decks cards or ATC cards. So this is one that I did. It's very similar to the other one that I did. It's using the paper from Alani's Dream created by Tina Loves the Craft here on YouTube. And I just added some die cuts of some leaves in like this gold iridescent paper and I think that it turned out super cute. Next one that I did is this Halloween theme memory decks card and oh my goodness I love it so much. So I did add some black snow tool throughout in between the layers and I think that that texture and color just really made it pop as well. I had these little buttons that I purchased from Amazon that I used here as a flower center and I think that that turned out so cute and I don't know if you can tell but the paper has like candy corn all over it. I used some stickers of candy corn in between here and these candy corn stickers were gifted to me from Cat Cats and Cali. I think that that turned out super cute. This um this little jack-o'-lantern here, this little jack-o'-lantern here, and this back button as well are all from the same set from Amazon. So super cute. And then the next one I created is this memory dex card, and it's for the fall. And wow, I really love the way that it turned out. In between the layers of this flower, I use some gold glitter tool from Dollar Tree, and that's how that turned out. And then I got these sparkly leaves from a pack that I purchased from Hobby Lobby last year. Um, so I was able to use it on the memory decks card and I think that it just turned out so cute. I have a little sentiment here that says hello fall and a little pumpkin down here in the corner. I love the paper too. The paper that I'm using is this DCWV Harvest Delight and I purchased this from Tuesday morning on a recent haul. So I love, love, love all of the double-sided sheets that are in this paper pad. I think that it is super cute. And then to go with this memory decks card, I also created an artist trading card. And this is what I came up with. I use the same tool that I use on the background here. This yellow background paper here has texture in it. And I think that that is so cute. I did get that paper from Cat Cats and Cali. Oh, just a little sequence on top. And then I just have a little tag that says the good life that is from a Maggie Holmes paper pad. And, and then this little strip of paper here is also from Harvest Delight. And I also took some of the little flowers that I had left over from cutting this memory decks card. And I made a little flower on here. And I think that just turned out super cute. So you guys, this is what I'm submitting today for hashtag ATC MDC open collab. Make sure you go and check out all of the ladies that are participating on today and show them some crafty love. Until next time, you guys. Bye.